Alright guys, and welcome back to more Tales of Exilia 2. We are here about to start up another character side story. I do not know who this character's story is, but we are here in Marksburg and we're gonna find out. Rowan again, maybe? That's a nice breeze. Oh, I could stand here all day. Alright, and I was looking at the status element or the status of the affinity with everybody. And right now, Alvin is actually has the highest affinity with Luger, er, Luger, Luger, right now. And I was thinking maybe it's because they're both, or not Rize Maxians, but both Olympians. But then I thought about it. I was actually playing with Alvin a lot off camera when I was trying to learn like his breaker charge combos and stuff. So maybe that's why his affinity is most highest right now. But maybe he gets an additional boost because he is, you know, an Olympias. But anyway, we need to boost up Muse and Gaius. And we also need to boost, yeah, those two. We even, damn, we're super high with Leia in. I didn't even expect myself to be that high with Leia with uh, Luger. Alright, without further ado, let's start up this next uh, side quest. Hopefully it's not as short as it was before. Her first chapter was extremely short. The Great Bunny Cans race. Oh boy. Luger? Um. Well, Jude seems to be looking for you. Jude? Why? Apparently, they're handing out samples of Rolo's beloved kitty crisps in front of the station. There's a limited supply, so he suggests you don't dawdle. <laughs> 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 Rolla left too. Have you heard of it? Ah, an event in which players race to complete a designated job first. I believe it's a common competition here in Marksburg. People even wager on the results, or so I have heard. Interesting. The prizes are boss. <laughs> I hear today's winner will get a bunnykins. Oh my, that trendy toy is sure to bring out stiff competition. Boss but from prizes. Rize Maxians can't compete unless they have at least one Olympian on their team. Wow. Yeah, they're afraid Riza Maxians will use spirit arts to cheat if they're not supervised. That's dumb. No worries, I'll go with you. Why are you looking at me like that? <laughs> I'll go with you. Hey, we didn't even have to ask. Thank you. Oh, it is on. Then speed is what we need. Let us make haste to the reception area. Yes, let's. Yes, let's play Speed Quest, the video game. All right, so it looks like we gotta we gotta literally speed run a plot point that speed run. Oh my goodness, that is that is groundbreaking gameplay. Oh, that looks like who we're looking for. Ooh, who is this? This random dude. Then consider yourself registered. Godspeed. All you gotta do is clear the job selected by the agent, grab your prize ticket, and bring it back to me. The first one to bring me that ticket wins the grand prize. This year's hottest toy, a premium limited edition bunny kid. Interesting. <laughs> Miss Elise? Sorry, I was just lost in thought. This is our big chance. We have to win this for Elle. Don't carry it all on your shoulders. You have our full support, you know. Games of chance like this seem to be something of a national pastime here in Olympias. I'm feeling the culture shock. All right, so now what? Complete the job and get the voucher. All right, where do we go? Do I talk to him again? Uh, okay. It's epic ass music right now. Reminds me of something from Star Ocean, to be honest. Speed Quest, Prize Voucher. Resolve High Road, huh? So we gotta go to Resolve High Road and beat this guy. Time to speed run. Hurry! We gotta go to Resolve. They still gonna be playing this epic music? 
please. Yes, they're still playing the epic music. Speak, speak, speed running. Speed running. Speed running. Speed, 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 speed running. Speed running. Running, 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 run, 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 running, running. Let's go, speed running. All right, let's whoop some ass. Oh, I'm gonna cheat, all right. I'm gonna put it on easy so I can speed run extra fast. Report yourself. Woo! Oh my God! Where'd you learn that, guys? We're in this together. All right. Let's recover our TP with Gaius and Luger. Onward. Yeah. Onward. Yeah. They refuse to use the Mystic Arc. I'm here. Now this dude will not stagger. Let's hope you don't mind. Oh, you're done. Yo, know, we can't be watching that. We speed running. We gotta skip every cutscene. <laughs> speed, speed, speed running. Speed, 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 speed running. Speed, 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 speed running. Speed, speed, speed. Oh. Whoa! Hold up! What the hell? Did y'all see that? I didn't even charge it and it. Does Shivery give you the pop? Immediately give you power charge? I think it immediately gives you power charge. Hold on. I'm gonna see if I can activate Shivery. I'm gonna see if it works. Right now, I don't have a charge. I don't have a charge right now, right? My apologies. Damn it, I'm trying to activate it, but you know what? Screw it. Yeah, it does give you power charge. You're done. Dude. It, it immediately gives you power charge. That's broke. Could you take a look at my GHS for me? It uh, appears to be broken. What? I need to insert some sort of power source, you say? <laughs> you gotta charge it, homie. You had z you had ten bars. You had ten bars before we left here. All right, so now we need to warp back immediately to Marksburg, Olympian's entrance. Run to the board, hand in the board to get the ticket, get the ticket, and run back to the guy. We gotta speed run. Speed, 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 speed running. Speed, 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 speed running. Speed, 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 speed running. Speed running. Speed, 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 running. Nice, we got the Mega Lightning I didn't hand in before. Two birds with one stone. Speed, 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 running. Speed, 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 running. Luger, we gotta do this. Speed, 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 running. Speed, 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 running. <laughs> Welcome back. Do I spy a prize ticket? Yes, you do. Let's just tally your completion time. Oh ho! Looks like we have our winner. Damn right! Congratulations on trouncing the competition. Yes. And now the moment you've been waiting for. Let me grab your grand prize. We win. This is a bunnykins. What the? This looks generic. Is maybe they gave us the wrong fries? It's gotta be! I was under the impression the grand prize was a bunnykins. Exactly! A bunnykins! A bunnykins! And not just any bunnykins. This is an ultra premium signature series deluxe plus plus handmade limited edition bunnykins! What? Any resemblance to any other bunnykins is purely coincidental. Warranty not valid in Olympias or Risa Max. You see, is bunnykins responsible. Is B U N N I E? Look, the logo's slightly different. 
Cut the crap, creep. Anybody would think the prize was a real Bunnykins. Oh, no, no, no! Don't be absurd. The real Bunnykins was a limited production run. You're out of luck if you want one now. Which is all the more reason to cherish your brand new Bunnykins! Minissimo! Boo! This is terrible! What a scam! We put our life on the lines for a fake ass Bunnykins? Our speed ramp for this? Is that a text from Luna? Yeah, I told her what we were up to today. She was worried about me. I replied that we won, but that the Bunnykins was a phony. The Bunnykins might have been fake, but your desire to help Ellie certainly wasn't. Well said. You have nothing to be ashamed of, young miss. Hey, hey, answer me! Hey, hey! <laughs> hey, hey, answer me! You did. <laughs> Don't give up. I know Elle will be touched by what you try to do for her. I'll see if I can find a Bunnykins for you. Sounds like you've made a true friend. Yeah. She's probably trying to repay me for that little thing I did. I made her a custom GHS ringtone as a symbol of our friendship. Nice! Her phone rings in my voice! Isn't that cool? Ah, like what you have. That was a YouTube I tutorial you, you looked up, right? such a ringtone for my device. Sorry, Rowan. I can't give it to you. <laughs> it's just for me and Luna. <laughs> Limited edition. I'm not giving up. I'm going to find a Bunnykins. I'd be a lousy big sister to Elle if I couldn't. It's the grown-up thing to do. There you are. Did you get any kitty crisps? Yeah, loads of it. Rollo's gonna get fatter than ever. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good thing, man. Them cats will get unhealthy. They'll, you know, start doing some stuff that you don't want them to do. Like dying. You're an interesting person. You know all sorts of things. And, well, I feel like I can really count on you. Here, from Elisa's heart. I hope we can get to know each other even better. Since you took that, you're obligated now. Damn. <laughs> you dirty rat people. Art amplifier. Elise's playmate. And she's got her original outfit. She's taller now, too, so I wonder how she looks in it. Oh my gosh, she's still got the chains. She still got the gold pimp chains on her. Obligated. I'm obligated to love you for several years. For 18 years. Oh no. Spirit 3 skill. Oh yeah, you damn right I'm equipping that. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Look at all these guards. I should probably equip one of these guards. Alright. So it looks like we completed Elise's side quest. We did it all we did all that speed running for no damn reason, man. I'm extra salty. So what we want to do now is go immediately towards. Oh boy. You know where we gotta go, right? So we gotta go to the Sea Haven. We gotta go to the Sea Haven and go pretty much to Leia and Jude's hometown. That's where we gotta go. I forgot what it was called, but I think we are about to learn what it was called again. La Ronde! La Ronde! La Ronde! Harambe! Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Awesome. The Isle of Quay Inquiry. <laughs> what an effective idea. Leave it to the privileged elite to find a way to make their lives even You're easier. You're still complaining about that and I heard a cat. What? Anyone can post a job request? Why didn't you say anything sooner? What the? I can catch a cat? Where? Let's watch this skit first. Huh. So this is Jude's hometown. Doesn't seem too shabby. It's my hometown too. My family runs the local inn. My dad's cooking is world famous. I'm sure he cooks it with love. Let's say, I'm sure he cooks it with love. If I picked the other one, it would have given me affection towards Jude. Yep. Love is the secret ingredient. Love? You season your food with abstract emotions? I prefer to focus on flavor <laughs> myself. Hey, I'll have you know that love is essential when cooking. 
Although... That love hasn't always come across to the Eater. My, my. Sounds like Leia's suffering from a heavy heart. What's your diagnosis, Jude? What? Me? I'm not sure I understand, but if there's something troubling you, Leia, feel free to talk to me about it. Uh, yeah, thanks. <laughs> he really doesn't understand. What does any of this have to do with cooking? <laughs> I'll tell you what it has to do with cooking. Play that George Michaels. Still on. Adrian! We've caught an awful lot of cats. Are they all friends of yours, Rolo? <laughs> he sneezed. They're not really Rolo's friends, more like his subjects. He's basically their king. What? So he's the Gaius of cats? Their king? Wow, Rolo's not pussyfooting around. <laughs> Jews allergic Ever to since cats. We got all these cats together. I haven't been able to stop sneezing. He says, "Meow if you ever need help and he'll save you." Is that right? His heart's as big as his belly. <laughs> That's impressive. I'm glad you're the benevolent kind of king. <laughs> Let's hear it for the king. Bravo. All hail Rollo. Rollo. <laughs> Jill's been suffering because of the cats. We got 50 cats, homie. I'm happy about that. Hmm. Where to? So the more cats we have, the more items we can find, right? Or something like that? But anyway, we need to find some pig feet from Neakara. Hopefully he can find some here. Let's give him some catnap. Good luck! Some catnip. Hopefully he'll find it extra quick. Rune brands. A pair of swords infused with spirex, allowing them to strike harder than normal. Ooh, nice. Let's get it. We got money, too. We got money. 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 Ah, I get it. Money. 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 Ah, I get it. Money. 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 We, we get it. Money. 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 If money was a Pokemon, they'd be like, money. Money, 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 money. <laughs> All right, so it looks like we can get two things for her. Let's give her the precious wand. The Juta, he doesn't need. Well, we might. He already has it. I'm buying doubles of things. It looks like. What the? For some reason, I, I guess I was finding some items. And I didn't even realize it. I was finding weapons and I never equipped them. Oh, I think I never equipped it because his intelligence goes down. But you know what? It might be worth it because of the AC boost. He can act more and he can act faster. Act faster, jump higher. Man, I ain't a part of this system. So I threw it on the ground. <laughs> oh, let's see. A true swordsman craft his own weapon. Boom, equip it. Violent pin. Wild flower pin. Physical defense goes down, but everything else jumps up significantly. All right. Undertow plus. All right, what are we getting rid of here? River? No. Undertow. We want to get rid of Undertow. We can make Gale. Extracts the wind from Elemental Aura. It has a faster rate than Gust. Holy cow, let's do it. If it's four, if it's four, oh my goodness. I'm equipping that to somebody. Sky Soldier. When attacking in the air, damage dealt to enemies increased by 25 and TP consume decreases by 25%. Wow, they really promote doing stuff in the air in this game. Oh, Mega Lightning Bolt. I might. Why did not have this on? He had Lightning Bolt to begin with. We got Gus now, right? Gale. Increases it by three. Good stuff. Bonfire. Man, this ain't Dark Souls, so get that shit out of here. The last tight, it'll give her. 
give her waterfall. She'll love it. Rain of fire, erupt cast. Let's just have them focus on maybe fire or something. Cavern. Aurora. How many points does he have? He has a lot of points everywhere. Rowan's pretty balanced right now. So we it doesn't matter where we put him. Let's just give him the bonfire. He has starfire. This ain't Teen Titans, so get this shit out of it. Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait a minute. Let's have him focus. Hmm. Starfire plus. Alright. And what we'll do with Jude is actually give him something else. Let's give him... Yeah, let's give him flame. He really needs it. He has a lot of points in water, light. He needs it in wind. So let's give him gust. He really needs a lot of wind. She needs a lot of everything. So let's put her on a multi. Let's put it on something like lightning bolt. Alvin, oh my goodness. He needs wind really bad. He needs wind a lot. She needs wind a lot as well. Holy cow, dude. What's her second one? She needs the most. Nope, she just needs a lot of wind. Everybody needs wind, dude. <laughs> damn, is it? Damn, everybody's got wind right now. Alright. So I guess what I'll do is put her on... Rain of Fire. Cavern, she can stay on this one. Unless there's another one that's available where she gets two or something. Air Pressure, Blue Sphere. Undertow. Air Swimmer. Confront, backstep, jump, or quickly fall in the air once. Whoa. Shenanigans, dude. You can play this game however you want. It's insane. Alright, so what we're going to do here now is actually start up the next quest with Leia. What I did probably, what I uh, edited out most likely was me just aligning everybody to a different alien orb so they can get some more diverse skill points so they can learn different arts and the skills and whatever so here we go let's start up Leia's story Leia's big scoop big scoop hmm. what up Alvin sound like you to be lost in thought oh hey Luger I got a text from my editor he asked if I figured out the answer to his question yet the question was something about what it takes to write an article, right? So, do you have an answer yet? When we met Agria in that fractured dimension, remember what she said about Olympians? How'd that make you feel? Real sad. Let's say parts of what she said rang true. When you know people on both sides of the fence like we do, it's hard to take one side. I feel like this directly relates to my editor's question, and how I felt interacting with the station attendant. Olympians and Rizamaxians have a different perspective. That much I know is true. But if I go beyond that simple thought, and I think about what's really important... No! Oh, <laughs> I can't make up my mind! <laughs> I'll just do it. If it'll put this thing to rest, I'll write an article about what that station agent said. Now you're sounding like the Leia we know and love. So what's next? Go interview the guy in the station again? No. If I interview him, it'll be at the end. He's my inspiration for the piece. I need to interview a wider range of people, or the article will end up just being my own opinion. What's wrong with your opinion? I'll help with the research. Might as well. Thanks. That's but what we're here for. I want to know what real people have to say, what they're really thinking, and then I'll put those thoughts together piece by piece. Sounds good. All right, let's do it. All right, now I'm fired up. I'm gonna go tell my editor. Later. Later, Tater. You could just text him, you know. 
Or not. <laughs> she went all the way? What? That was the quickest chapter ever. Ever. Alright, I'm gonna write an article that will leave my editor speechless. Speechless, huh? I can certainly visualize that, but probably not in the sense that you meant. I don't have time for your witty repartee. Step one is research. Step two is more research. Great journalism is written with shoe leather and elbow grease. Oh, you're not kidding around. Still, I'd, uh, I'd bring a pen. <laughs> so, do you know who you want to talk to? Yeah, I want to interview three sources who are involved in different aspects of Riza Maxian Olympian relations. Rowan? But... I don't think any of them will be easy to track down. Why not submit your request through the Spurious Corporation's job postings? In fact, I happen to know an elite Spurious agent who seems positively enthusiastic to help. Huh. Oh, that's a great idea! I'll give it a try! Thanks for helping me out, guys. Hey, do you think my penmanship's gotten any better? I think it's got a real flair to it, you know? Flair! Really? What's flair? <laughs> we don't have that in our de in our dictionaries over here in Olympias. What the hell is Flair? Oh, you mean Ric Flair, the wrestler? No, Flair, 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 what? Ric Flair? <laughs> Blip Flair, what? Gravity Well. All right. So what we want to do here? Go to. Do -do 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 I was just about to check something out, guys. I don't even know what I was just about to check out, but right now, all I know is I'm going to save the game, take a short break, and once we come back, we'll be back with more Tales of Exilia 2.